I know I said I wasn't going to be doing any editing, but I'm going to have to do a little bit. And since I'm going to be doing a little bit, let's just talk about my shoe issue. I discovered that I guess I'm a shoe collector now. So the first pair that I found, and at the time I needed another pair of shoes. I really did. And $40 is my limit that I will ever pay for a pair of shoes. I don't care what it's made of. There's nothing in a shoe, material-wise, that should cost more than 40 bucks. I'm, I'm serious. And now that I've discovered winners, and I'll tell you all my tricks because I'm not afraid to share my money-saving tricks with all of you. Winners and Marshalls. So this pair was there, and I mean, I love Chucks, I love Converse, I'm a child of the 80s. So, and I knew that these were like collector's special editions and they were on sale for 30, so I bought them. Then I came home and I looked them up and I realized that they're more than that, they're like something like 200, no longer made, whatever. So I was super stoked about that and I was happy with just these. And then last week we went and I saw these. They kind of look almost the same, I know, but they're also special editions. They still have other pairs in different colors for anybody that's interested. They have them in army green at Marshalls. Different. There's only a few sizes left, but I know there's other people out there that clicked. Converse All-Stars. Um, these are like the modern ones and I don't know how they ended up at Marshalls and Winners. I mean, I know, because that's how they buy stuff. But these brands, the modern line from everything I can find is not actually available in North America. It's like a European thing. And these are like super neat. One, they're super comfortable, but two, they're actually really thick in line. So these are like winter chucks. Like not walk in the slush, you know, but they don't have much grip though. You might not be okay. And then I found these yesterday. Yeah, I found me some Rihanna Fenty Pumas. They were $23. 23! I looked them up online. You can't buy them anymore. They're special edition, all that kind of stuff again. Like 200 bucks if you want to buy them online. But I found them at Winners. So am I going to wear them? Yeah. Technically, if I was smart, I'd buy all of those and buy, sell them again on eBay and make a bazillion dollars. But I'm not interested in making money. However, I might still collect shoes if I have extra money. If I can go to work, <laughs> my head can heal. Um, but yes, I'm not paying full price. I refuse to. I don't get the point. Why would I go to a store and buy a brand new pair of shoes and pay them like a hundred bucks? When I can buy, you know, last year's model at Winners for something like 20 or 30 bucks? Because sometimes last year's model happens to be collector's edition and worth even more money. But I don't care how much money it's worth. They're pink, they're satiny, hello. Does that not scream me? And then on the fact of everything else, like these, also, scream me. Because I have not multiple personalities. No. No, that whole multi Not many people have DID, which is the real name for multiple personalities. A lot of people claim to, not the point. The point is, is that women, men, people, depending on the day, you know, you can wear different things, look different, Depending on the mood of the day, why not? Go for it. Play around with stuff. If it makes you happy to wear a purple shirt, wear a purple shirt. I don't care what gender, whatever you identify, what you were born, I don't care. That doesn't matter. It shouldn't matter anymore and it really doesn't. If you want to wear something, go for it. If you want to have orange hair, get yourself some orange hair. If you want to have black, black, black eyes, do it. Whether you, I think you can pull it off or not isn't really important. What is important is that you think you look good in it. And that's my whole message quickly in there to Emily Susanna. So thank you so much for speaking out about it. I've already given you my Instagram thoughts on that.